We are just hours away from one of the most anticipated events of the year in Detroit, America's Thanksgiving Parade. And as we take a live look from Chopper 7, things are getting set up and ready to go for the big party along Woodward. Thank you for staying with us. I'm Brian Abel. And I'm Glenda Lewis. 7 Action News reporter Tierra Braddock got an inside look at the excitement and what people are looking forward to most. It's quiet right now in downtown Detroit, but that won't be the case on Thanksgiving Day. Thousands of people will be flooding these streets for the Thanksgiving Day parade, the Lions game, and much more. We love the city of Detroit. We love uh, the floats. We love Thanksgiving in Detroit. Martin Weiser and his family were walking down Woodward Avenue on Wednesday, looking at the floats that will be in a Thanksgiving Day parade. Weiser says they won't be at the parade, so they wanted to check out the floats a day early. We love being able to walk around uh, Woodward Avenue with no cars on it. And the Weisers weren't the only ones who decided to enjoy the floats a little early. First reaction when walking down, seeing all the floats. Very exciting. It really gets us ready for Thanksgiving for the parade tomorrow. Tony Michaels, the CEO of the parade company, says it took a year and more than 1,500 volunteers to get everything ready for the Thanksgiving Day Parade. It's one of the largest events uh, in the Midwest, the largest in our state by far. Michael says it's going to be great seeing people come together for the parade and other events going on in downtown Detroit. For a lot of the people, we'll do the turkey trot, watch the parade and then jump over to Ford Field. I mean, that's the trifecta. That's the perfect trifecta on Thanksgiving morning. Speaking of the Lions, we caught up with the Wright family who drove 10 hours from Virginia just so they can see the Lions play on Thanksgiving Day. We've always been Lions fans. We watch every game, but we've always, me and him's always talked about coming on Thanksgiving and we never, for this year, I finally was able to do it. The Wrights say they will even try to go to the parade before the game. We're going to be up early so we can. <laughs> If you are planning on enjoying any of these Thanksgiving Day events in downtown Detroit, make sure to check out our website to see what roads will be closed. In downtown Detroit, Tierra Braddock, 7 Action News.